Good morning. It's time to make the donuts. I have to be honest, I had some trouble getting out of bed this morning. Um, I'm excited to record the rest of this chapter. It's chapter 10, um, the collaboration chapter. And, um, you know, I'm just, is this day, I think this is day 30 or 31 of getting up at 4 a.m. 4.15, I'm exaggerating. Um, but I'm just, I'm, you know, just tired of it. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I like what I'm doing. I'm just tired of this part of the routine. And, um, and as I sat down this morning, I realized two really important things is that the work of this collaboration chapter and indeed other parts of the Coaching Agile Teams book are very um, much based on the work of two other people. Um, one is no longer with us and one is at the end of life. And it makes me really emotional this morning. And I really want to honor them in the way I um, represent their work and the way I build on it. And I also want you to know who they are. So Jean Tabaka, four years ago, died at the age of 61. It was a really big shock to all of us. She wrote an amazing book, Collaboration Explained. If you haven't gotten it already, get it right away. It, it was, I can't even tell you how many ways I used that book, used it and use it still today. And the other person is Lee Devon, someone I met in the Agile community, um, gosh, well, I guess 11 years ago, because he turned out to be my mentor for writing the Coaching Agile Teams book. He was just so, so generous. And he came to the Agile community from theater. Um, I'm not sure exactly how it happened. Maybe Tobias Mayer brought him in, but I, I met the two of them together. And, um, and Lee at that time was in his mid, maybe late seventies. So that was 10 years ago. You can do the math. Um, and I contacted his wife yesterday and he's not doing well. So, you know, I just really want to do a good job for both of them. Um, oh, and Lee's book is, he has a couple of them, but the one that I really drew from and the one that first sort of set the imagination of the Agile community alight um, 10 or 11 years ago was, is the one called Artful Making, What Managers Need to Know About How Artists Work. And it's just a beautiful piece of work. And then I had the pleasure of working with Lee and designing um, a workshop with him. And so a lot of what's in this chapter is from our design work of that workshop. And this morning, I drew uh, an Inspire Me card. And there's a person laid out flat on the tennis court. And it says, there is a difference between giving up and knowing when you've had enough. You know, so here I am, poor me, having to wake up at four o'clock in the morning to do this incredible privilege of recording this book. And I definitely have not had enough. And it is definitely not time to give up. <laughs> so I'm in a tender place this morning. Um, and both remembering Jean and um, sending out lots of love to Lee this morning and getting this particular card are helping. So we'll see. You let me know later if um, all of this comes through in this recording. It's the second half of chapter 10. All right. I hope you have a great day.